this is a, a trick by a friend of mine named Brother John Hammond. He was a Mariner's brother. It uses four cards. I want you to notice that I have exactly one, two, three, four cards and two hands. That there are no extra cards and no extra hands involved in this trick. And as I said, it's a story about two pairs of identical twins who were going out on a double date. The king of spades represented the guy. He was going out on a date with an attractive dark-haired lady represented by the queen of spades. And this guy had a twin brother. Identical twins looked exactly like him. And he was going out on a double date with the sister of the girl who looked exactly like her. Well, there were a lot of places they could go and things they could do, and they went to a bar. And while they were at the bar, the two ladies excused themselves and went to the powder room together. And the one guy looks around, and he noticed over in the other corner of the bar a rather attractive-looking redhead. Oh. So he went over and started a conversation. The next guy looked around, and that redhead had a twin sister, identical twins, looked exactly like her. Three sets of identical twins in the same place? What are the odds? Well, they went over and started talking to the two red-headed ladies. But meanwhile, the plot thickens, because the first lady comes out of the powder room. She looks around and she sees her date sitting there with a redhead. She didn't care for the situation at all. The next girl looks around and she sees her date with a redhead too. And they decided they had to do something about the situation, so they did. The first woman walked across the bar. She went up to her date and she grabbed her by the arm and she said, you came in with me and you're leaving with me. It's time to go. And they left. And the next woman walked across the bar and up, up to her date and says, Dear honey, it's time to go. And they too walked out of the bar. Now I know you're staring with the help of the camera at my hands. And you can see the cards larger than life. And that there are only four of them. And you're probably saying, Paul, what happened to the two good-looking redheads we thought we saw a moment ago? Well, don't worry, because everything had a happy ending. You see, about ten minutes later, a good-looking guy came. And he started talking to the first redhead. And a few minutes later, another good-looking guy came around and started talking to the next redhead. And they all had a good time, and that is a true story. Thank you.